Hey, Grant. What? Hey, do you do, would you possibly be interested in trying to pick up a 59 Impala? How much? You guys are asking 60 for it. Oh. Uh, hold on. One sec. I'm I'm cooking here. up some burgers. Hell. Oh. oh, are you now? Well, the grill's outside, you know. Is this the Apex Game PC? Yeah. Huh. Apparently, you can use some code to get percentage off. You gotta use the code squad, though. I don't know what the percentage is. Okay. All right, so take a look at this. Yep. Yep. Holy crap. This thing's yeah. mint. It's got the so, Cameo well, Corey Pauly paint job. Yeah, it's it's one of the more rare colors. The only problem with this car right now is that I can tell that they did an engine swap on this thing. Uh -huh. It's supposed to have a smaller little V8, I believe like a two, yeah, 283, at least from factory, unless it was an inline six. But it's got a 409, which came in the 64s, and that's like a, that's basically a race motor. So it's still got a big block in it, but it's not original motor. Paint's faded. Uh, it looks like they repainted it from the photos I'm looking at here. I can see so off the glare. It looks like underneath that they're trying to do a couple things. I mean, it, yeah. it's the problem with these cars, though, is that any of them that are in good condition, people are going to just charge out the rear for them. Yeah. I mean, I, unless it's literally been crushed, it's not it's 50,000 or more. It's pretty mint for the price they're asking though. Yeah, I mean it's they'll probably still have a little bit of work I can guarantee you some things probably won't work, but You want to go have these? Probably could. Wouldn't okay. be a bad idea. Okay. I'm down. I'll give the guy a call. See if he can meet tomorrow morning. See if we can meet down there tomorrow morning. You said it's in Burksville? Yeah. Okay. Just north of Burksville about a mile and a half. Okay, I'll give him a call here. I just ah. I just I just got off the phone with Jed. He's down. Okay. Is he now? Um, okay. he has church at 8 a.m., but he's going to be back at 10. 10 will work good. Heck, by the time okay. we get out of church, too, that'll be perfect. Mm, I don't know. He's I pretty, might have to work. He's I pretty tight on price, though. Afterwards. Okay. Oh, well, I wouldn't doubt that. Yeah. Hey, we got to give the guys a tour of the place. Okay. The shouts. Uh, which, which one's my room up here again? Uh, the right room. Okay. We, 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 I guess we can start with that. Yeah. Show me your room, Buck. <laughs> what kind of sick joke is this? <laughs> Go to bed, Buck. Go to bed. No. You know, you know, I, I'm gonna like this. I'm like, I like yeah, this. No, no, All right. No, no. There's, there's, there's my, there's my, my crew right there. I mean, we got Pocahontas. We got Snow White. We got Mulan. All right. She is a bad mamma jamma. All right. Saved all of China. Plus, I like Mushu. All right. Well. Oh, you? oh, oh! So now you got Master Chief in here, and you didn't give me that one. Well, you could have. You could. We we can we can play rock paper scissors for it. Is there a master bedroom somewhere? Yeah, you can have master bedroom. I'll take I'll take this bedroom. I'm taking the pink one. Okay. Okay. Good night. <laughs> but uh, anyways, we have this is a shouse, uh created by Harry Armstrong Jr. So it's like part house, part shop. So it's pretty cool for us too. Just out of college dudes living here. This is sweet. But anyways, uh, master bedroom in here. This is going to be Buck's room. He's got master bedroom in here. Uh, we have laundry room. We have toilet. The decor is just spot on here. I love it. We got kitchen. Two bedrooms up there, spare bedrooms. And then we got the actual shop in here. This is Pride and Joy. Silverado K30 Cummins Swapped truck with a 10 inch lift on 34s the flatbed love this pickup and then we're kind of we're kind of old school dudes anyways uh, that's box truck i'll let him talk about that we got my 72 1972 f100 40 000 miles on her there's a tad bit of rust not enough to even show you guys almost but it is 99 percent mint and then we got the general lee of course me and buck own that 50 50 but uh this is kind of our collection kyle what? When did you hire Kyle? Kyle who? Behind you. Holy Toledo, dude! <laughs> when I didn't even here? see Kyle. What's up, Kyle? He's the he's the paint guy. Holy crap! This scared he, the crap out of the, me. He's the paint guy. <laughs> did he give you a scare, laddie? This is just a this is a truck that we have around here. This is I mean we kind of used it for a handful of things. It just kind of sits there. My daily's out there in the driveway. Forgot to show you guys Bucks the daily. So that is the daily. 1972 Ford F100. 
We got ourselves some DTS star all-terrain mud tires on this, as well as, uh, you know, got got to have our our. It's not really a heavy-duty truck, but it's got heavy-duty suspension. So we got eight lugs on it mm. instead of the traditional six or five because of two-wheel drive. Uh, bed rails. I we do. I think I have this. I have CB whips on it, but I don't have the radio installed yet. I was gonna try and do that because I got a snowplow bracket on the front. Seventy-eight thousand original miles. It's it's got the three hundred two V eight in that sucker, even though it it it's having some breathing troubles. Needs a new air filter. Probably gonna need to look into the distributor, but it's a solid built truck. We kind of we kind of like our seventy-two Fords. Yes, yes, we do very much so. But hey, we K, K, K30 with the Cummins. That's a neat little no, match. No, no. I we need a Cummins swap with this car. No. Yes. No. Yes. Isn't isn't yours on the lift? Isn't that 383 <laughs> Stroker swapped? That's got a Chevy motor in it, doesn't it? No, it's got original, but I was considering doing it. Yikes. I mean, I know this got the. This has got our Cummins in it. Our. Yeah, or, or W three hundred and fifty on it, so that that's we that's could, a little bit of a powerhouse. If she, if she if she ever gives us trouble, we could. How about we swap it, put it in the general? <laughs> <laughs> that would be good. Come and swap okay. generally. Anyways, we better get going to bed. Got to get up for church, and then. Yeah, uh, and I gotta go balance my life over here for a second. Okay. Well, I think Buck's getting ready to go here. Made some eggs. We're gonna head off. Got back from church quick. We're gonna get loaded up. Hey, you want to take the 72 or do you want to take the Cummins? I should say the K30. Uh, I was gonna take this if you wanted to take the K30. Okay. Because that one's gonna be more suitable to tow the trailer, of course. No, we're good. You got the winch just in case. You, well, she should run. Yeah, she I should. Say, I think the car. I mean, if they're asking 60 grand, that sucker better run. Yeah, true. Okay. Uh, can you help me get backed up? Thought you had a backup, city boy. Hey, man, I'm used to all those cameras. Wait mean, for that it. Thing's, that thing's just full of blind spots. You ready, Buck? Yeesh! Oh, Started yeah. Started didn't sound too good. Oh, boy. Look at that. You think he might be compensating for something? <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Come on back now. There you go. Right there? Pop. Yep. Yeah. Well, a little off, but you'll be fine. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll just follow you. Alright, well, I'm gonna shut the door first. We're not letting the heat out. Oh, yeah. It's kinda cold. Don't want that beer to freeze. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> you on the CB walk? Yeah. Hurry it up, old grandpa. Burn some rubber. I mean, I know they said we should be uh, down the speed limit, but uh, I don't see no cop out here this morning. Get on her! Whoa! I'm going 87 <laughs> along the road. But I have to call Kevin on you because of the oh my! <laughs> Berksville's a nice town. I haven't been this way for a while. Literally. So this is it. Should be. I mean, that's it up in the barn, I suppose. Yeah. You go talk to Jed. I'm going to go take a peek at this sucker. Okay. Hey, Jed. Yep. Yeah. Grant, talk to you on the phone. Yeah. Hey, yeah. We're, we're here to look on it. Okay. You'll, you'll come out around back. Perfect. Okay. It looks just as good in person as it does in the pictures. It's, it's dash looks really nice, which is also good. I mean, the upholstery, it's, it's getting a little torn on the seats, but that's probably just because, I mean... Probably original seats, at least. Yeah. I don't 100% know. You should be able to pop the hood from the outside, because they don't have hood latches on these older cars. Yeah. Pop it. There we go. Is that original? No, that's what I'm saying. It's the 409. Mm. That's a boater from, like, 64. They stuck this in 64 Impala with the Super Sport editions, and... Oh, boy. Let me that's check underneath. That's a big motor. Is there any rust? Uh -huh. uh, not that I saw. It's a little hard to see. I mean, it looks yeah. like at some point somebody did some like uh, not not the bed liner stuff. It looks like someone undercoated it or something. Mm -hmm. At least protect the frame. You can tell it's obviously somewhat rusty, but I mean, it looks fairly original. Besides, I mean, like you could say, you can tell this paints 
been repainted at some point or mocked up a little bit. Yeah. Interior's solid. Wow. So you pop in it and see if you can get this puppy turned over. Okay. Ready? Give her a couple, say give her a couple pumps. Yeah. It's carbureted. Here we go. Oh. She well, sounds she's a little dry. Wife. She sounds a little dry, though. Hold on. Give her a couple more pumps. Come on. Come on. Let me get the... Come on. Oh. 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 Oh, oh, here we go, here we go, this one. Hang on, hang on, let me get a little more shots in there. Okay. All right, give her, give it to it. Okay. Oh. oh, well don't keep pumping the gas, you'll flood it. Hey, hey. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Give her. Oh, ho, ho. Not too bad. Yeah. Gauge, gauges don't work. Fuel gauge times off. We're missing a needle on the clock. I mean, overall, it seems fairly fairly solid, but. Check the lights. Yep. See if the signals work. Yeah, signals work. Yep. Hey, Jed, can we take her for a test drive? Hey, Jed, Jed said go ahead and give her. He said burn a little rubber if you need to. Uh, She'll go. I can't tell. There's a button underneath the dash. It's not nitrous. I know what you're thinking, um, Buck. Um, no. It. Hang on. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's better than nitrous. Oh, okay. So she needs a little uh, little help getting back up. <laughs> um, I mean, do you want to rip in it or do you want you me to rip ahead. in it? You go ahead. Four speed on the floor. Oh, fuck, we get... Oh, this thing needs an alignment! <laughs> Three... Oh. <laughs> well, she Don't goes, Buck, you better not have scratched her. Uh, I think after that, the undercarriage is probably a little scraped up. I mean, if you want to try and drive the thing, go but be my guest. Yeah, I'll jump in her. Hold on. Think it's worth 60 grand? <laughs> I think she's worth 60. I think she's worth all 60. I don't know. Well, I want to give him a fair price, honestly. Well, like you said, he's firm on 60. And I know I yeah. know there's a good set of uh, American uh, American Racing Torque Thrusts we could throw on this sucker. Ooh. Maybe change the paint job again on it. Cause, I mean, this, this, coral's, this coral's really nice on it. But I feel either a bright red, mm -hmm. blue, or even purple would pop. I agree. What do you say we offer him 58? He's pretty close. He's honestly really close on price. I think I think with what needs to be done with like the paintwork, more than likely. I mean, even even around like the edges of the fins, you can see the paint starting to chip, which is expected. But there's also it, it, it's a mainly original, so that's yeah. The, yeah. It, it's it's got no real body damage. So I mean, we can try and pitch 58. I'm not sure if he'll take it, but we'll see. If anything, let's meet him in the middle at 59, the age of the 50, the year of the car. Yeah. Yeah. So let's let's try that. I want, Cause I, I do really want this car. If anything, we're loading the we're loading my truck back up, and I'm driving the car back. <laughs> okay. Hey Jed. Yeah. So my buddy here, he wants. He's thinking it's only worth fifty-seven. Um, I'm thinking, would you take fifty-eight for the car? There's a couple things we'd want to change. Some paint mechanics with it. It runs and drives smooth, right, Buck? I mean it. Oh I, yeah. I, it, it didn't miss a beat. Um, it floats like a boat, and it's and is uh, basically worn out as the transmission is. Yeah. It's still got a fairly smooth clutch. Yeah. So I'm thinking we're at 58. Would you take 58? Jeez. Stuck at 60. Come on, man. Come on, man. Can you, okay, do us a favor. We're making this a joke out of it. Take it at 59. The year of the car. 1959. 59,000 in cash, right now. Hundred dollar bills. Awesome. Awesome. All right, we're loading yeah. my truck back up on the trailer because I'm taking the car home. <laughs> Hold on, we gotta pay him. We gotta pay him. Um, You're paying him. I'm I know. The car I know. Going. I got Jed. I got the cash in the truck. Let me grab it quick. Hey, hey, hand me the cash. 
There's your cash. Then it's a very, it's a very, very overpacked envelope. Okay. Heart, two heart, three heart, four heart, five, six, seven, fifty-eight thousand nine hundred, fifty-nine thousand. That is it. I don't think I missed anything. Okay. And title. Yeah, it looks good here. It's got your name on it. Just need a signature there. Okay. And I'll get that uh, recorded with the county. Okay. Perfect. Thanks, Jed. Hey, yep, no, we, uh, we'll enjoy it. I'm sure we will. Okay, we'll see you, Jed. Hey, are you seriously driving that thing home? Why would I not? Okay. Well, um, okay, I'll follow, you. I'll follow you. I'll follow you. I'll follow you. All right. Oh, be careful. Straps are not holding that truck on there very well. You need to get new attach points on oh. that. Okay. Stop driving her like a grandma. Get on her, Buck. Oh, well, I'd rather not drive it like a maniac around the corners. <laughs> Watch the those tracks. Fins, those fins, when they get on the air, they start picking up the back end of the car. It's half the reason people can't control these things. There he goes. Hey, you missed a turn. Okay, Buck should be here soon. I want to get that car on the lift. I'd, lo I'd love to take a peek underneath her. Oh, there's a flower pot there. I wasn't really looking. <laughs> Door's a little further to the left. Yeah, they didn't make backup cameras in 59, I don't think. No, but this thing's got more visibility than half the cars out there today. True. There you go. Oh, right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Dude. No rust. That must have been a dirt speck on it or something that I was looking at. Uh, well, I mean, it's got a dual exit exhaust. Yeah. Did these come stock with dual exhausts? No. Huh. So I'm saying it's a 409. It's a race motor. They did a motor swap to it. This car has been not necessarily tampered with, but it's been tampered with. Yeah. Factory I mean, original tampered with. Yeah. Good buy, well, in my opinion, though. I'd say so. Yeah. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching this one. Another barn find. We're hoping to do a bunch of different barn finds on this map. So if you have any recommendations, let me know, because I think it'd be cool. Pretty cool to have, like, a collection. Heck, maybe we can even build a shed next to the next to the house. Put another shop here. We'll see. But anyways, hey, thanks for watching this one. And me and Buck, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks, guys. Ooh.